Hi! Let's try to solve this sample problem from a review material ng CE. A tree stands on the edge of a small lake. A man stands on the opposite side of the lake, his eye being at a height 1.6 meters above the foot of the tree. He finds that the angle of elevation of the top of the tree is 38 degrees and the angle of depression of its reflection in the water is 56 degrees. Find the height of the tree. So notice na sa problem na to, ang sinasabi or ang given is the reflection and not the shadow. So before solving this problem, tignan muna natin ano ba yung pwede nating assumption for this by looking at some pictures ng reflection. So notice na in these pictures, yung height ng object is the same nung height ng reflection. So yun yung gagamitin natin for this problem. So drawing natin yung figure for this problem. So, let's say, ito yung ating lake. So, nasa magkabilang side, yung ating observer, and yung ating tree. Then, yung height ng observer is 1.6 meters above the foot of the tree. Then, ito yung magiging reflection. So, if the height of the tree, so, yun yung unknown, tawagin natin age, is age. Yung reflection niya is magkakaroon din ng, or yung height niya is also equal to age. Tapos, given yung angle of elevation as 38 degrees, and the angle of depression of 56 degrees. Paano natin ngayon masasolve itong height ng tree? So, notice na pwede tayong makagawa rito ng triangle. So, ito yung hypotenuse, yung height na to, and itong horizontal distance na to. So, dahil di natin alam yung horizontal distance na yan, tawagin natin siyang x. And itong height na to ay equal ba saan? So, kung yung total height nung 3 is age. Tapos, itong distance na to, 1.6. Therefore, itong distance na to ay equal sa age minus 1.6. So, next triangle na pwede nating mabuo is ito. Ngayon, ano ba yung magiging height na to? So, if this is age and this is 1.6, the total height for this is age plus 1.6 and yung horizontal distance is pareho lang na x if we're given an angle a side opposite of it and the adjacent side anong trigonometric function yung pwede natin gamitin so we know we can use tangent so drawing lang muna natin yung ating first triangle and sulat tayo ng relationship from that so, this is age minus 1.6. This is x and this is 38 degrees. So, tangent of 38 degrees is equal to opposite side. Age minus 1.6 all over x. So, we can solve for x. Or, gawin natin subject ng equation si x. So, x is equal to age minus 1.6 over tangent of 38. Next, sulat tayo ng equation or relationship for this triangle. The angle is 56 degrees. Adjacent side is x, and the opposite side is h plus 1.6. So again, using tangent, tangent of 56 degrees is equal to h plus 1.6 divided by x. And again, we can write or we can make the x as the subject of the equation. So, x is equal to 
h plus 1.6 divided by tangent of 56. So, meron na tayong equation ng x. So, kung ito equal sa x, and ito equal din sa x, pwede natin isilag sila as 1. So, we'll have h minus 1.6 over tangent of 38 equals h plus 1.6 over tangent of 56. So, cross multiply. H minus 1.6 times tangent of 56 is equal to H plus 1.6 tangent of 38. Then, distribute natin si tangent 38 and si tangent 56. Then, pag samasamahin na natin lahat ng like terms, so, we'll have here age tangent of 56 minus age tangent of 38. That is equal to 1.6 tangent of 38 minus or plus, kasi negative to. So, pag nilipat magiging positive, 1.6 tangent of 56. So, simplifying everything makukuha natin that h or using our calculators makukuha natin that h is just equal to 5.17 meters